there everyone, this is Tracy from Lavinia Stamps and thank you for joining me for another demonstration today. We're going to do a really nice, quick, simple card that I think looks so effective. And we're going to be using some of our pan pastels that we've now got in stock. These are gorgeous pastel, um, like a cake of pastel in a pot, just like this. And so we can use our smoothies or we can use some little tools with sponges on the ends just to create um, a beautiful background. Okay, so starting with the smoothie, I'm going to pick up the grey. And you can see how easy it is to blend. And now I'm just going to pick up a little bit of the green and blend that in. And then lastly I'm going to just bring in a little bit of the yellow as well. So you can see how quick and easy that really is. Okay, next step. I've got my tree stamp here and I'm going to be using the Nocturne Versafine Claire. So inking up, make sure the stamp is completely covered and then we're going to pop that down right in the centre there. Okay, give that a good press. Let that stamp just rest on the card a while. And let the ink soak in. Next, we're going to be using the Morning Mist. I'm going to stamp off very lightly and then I'm going to pop the trees next to the other ones and again just let that rest, give it a good firm press. And there we go. So we're going to repeat that now. Take off and again line those trees up and just pop them next to them like so. So we've got a lovely little bird stamp here. I'm going to pop that down just above the trees like so. So taking our mask now, we're going to pop that at the base of the trees and then we're going back to the nocturne and using the stencil brush we're going to go along the edge of that. This is to just ground the trees. Just take your time and just blend that colour. So now I'm going to use a little bit of the black again, just a small amount, very lightly. We're literally just going to dust over that edge. And that just stops that line being quite as harsh. So 
So we're going to dry this off now. We need to make it sure that it's completely dry before the next stage. Moving back to the pan pastels now. I wanted to create an effect that um, I saw in the park while I was walking the dogs the other day. Now you know when do you see that beautiful mist that's just below the trees, um, usually first thing in the morning. When you see that it's absolutely gorgeous. And I wanted to recreate that so I thought the pan pastels would work perfectly. They just go nicely over the top. And of course you can blend that white. And you can put as much or as little as you want. I think it gives it such a nice magical feeling. I think that's enough. So how quick and how easy was that? But I think sometimes simplicity is the best. Well, I hope you enjoyed that, guys. Thanks so much for joining me today. You take care and we'll see you real soon. Bye for now.